reverse coding for data extracted from a questionnaire or a survey in SPSS in which a participant or an individual had filled a questionnaire or a survey and he had uh, five options to uh, select for each questions and by giving a response to any of these items or questions in a questionnaire and the questionnaire is designed to have a five point liked scale from one to five one for strongly disagree two for disagree three for neither agree nor disagree four is for uh, agree and five for strongly agree so in this video clip i will show you how to use the recode function to reverse coding the data for a survey if you find this video useful do subscribe to the channel leave any comment in the indicated uh, box and activate the notification bell to receive the recent and uh, latest release uh, into the channel of several different video clip and click on the like icon and share the video link with others so the channel can expand and improve to include a large scope of different statistical method and how to analyze data using uh, several different uh, statistical packages such as SPSS, Excel, Stata, Jamovi, R Statistic or Statistics, Graphpad, Prism, GPower, Python and RevMan. Here in this data view in SPSS I had placed a data extracted or taken from a questionnaire and there are 300 participants who had answered these or filled this uh, survey or questionnaire and they answered the questions and the questions there were 30 questions or called items here from 1 to 30 and the questionnaire was designed that the participant will have to select from option one to five for answering any of these items option one stands for if we click here on this icon it stands for um as shown here one stands for strongly disagree and number two is for disagree and number um, three is for uh, neither agree nor disagree and number four is for agree and number five is for strongly agree to reverse coding the five point Likert scale here we'll use the function for record from and the way to do that click on transform and then scroll down here there are two options whether we can record the uh, values or the data into the same variable or record it into different variables i'm going to go for recording into same variable a new window will pop up and if i am interested in selecting part of these items and record them and leave the rest as they are uh, then uh, i have the option to do that but in this case i'm going to select all the items all, all the questions from question number 1 to 30 and drag them into the box here for numeric uh, variable so I will try to uh, record or reverse code the values then click on old and new values so we're going to give the value of 1 give it 5 so in the section here old value put 1 and for new value put 5 and click on icon for add for a value of two um, 
uh, convert that into uh, four so click on add and then for three we'll keep it as it is three click on add and for the value of four will be converted into uh, or uh, reverse coded into two and for five it will be reverse coded for one here the values are reverse coded one will be five and two will be four and three will be three and four will be two and five will be one if i click on continue and then click on ok all the values are uh, reverse coded as shown here now for this reverse coded data now one stands for strongly agree and number five for strongly disagree and don't forget to click on the variable view and then set up the values here uh, by um, giving each, val each value reverse coding them by removing all these uh, um, uh, labels and then reset them again uh, in a way that uh, one stands for strongly agree and then two for agree and then three four uh, uh, neither agree or disagree four for uh, disagree and five for strongly disagree if you click on OK and then all the um, labels change for item 1 and then the rest of the item to uh, uh, get, assign them the correct value for each or uh, the label for each value then click on this right click on it copy it and then select all the other uh, items and then uh, paste so to code them uh, properly and if we click on uh, this icon here the items from 1 to 30 uh, all are reverse coded with the proper labeling for each um, choice within this five likelihood scale just to uh, before finishing to show you how to uh, transform and record the uh, data into uh, different variables just click here and record into different variable and I'm just going to show you for one example which is item number one and if I click on item number one and select that drag it here into this area or box and give it a name let's say item uh, one uh, then R for reverse and then click on change and then click on old uh, and uh, um, new values uh, repeat the same step as I have done previously and then fill the uh, values here as shown before and uh, eventually a new uh, variable will be generated with the um, reverse code in them so this is the way to perform reverse coding using the transform function and then record either into the same variable or another variable or a new variable or different variable in SPSS for data that are based on five Likert scale if you are a student or a researcher and you have a data whether it is um, um, quantitative 
all qualitative and you want to perform a statistical uh, analysis on that data using any of the softwares listed here whether it's SPSS, Excel, Stata, Jamovi, R Statistics, Graphpad, Prism, Revman, GMP, Python then do contact me to arrange for either a one-to-one -one private tutor session or a training course uh, on any of these uh, statistical packages. My contact details are given here. So don't hesitate to uh, write to me or email me if you need uh, a private one-to-one uh, -one, uh, tutoring or a training course.